What's up, nerds? Welcome to NGR Radio, episode 53. I'm one of your hosts, Corey Deering, and alongside me, as always, Matthew Keel. Hi! Hey, Matt. You're late. Yep, I'm late. Only 13 minutes. It's all good. Only 13 minutes, yeah. I'm going you, know who, you know who was on time? Moose. Moose was on time. Yep. Chris was on time. Yeah, Chris was on time, too. Yep. Yep. No. Yep. Yeah. No. This is not new, Corey. This is not new. I know. <laughs> no, no. I mean, do you I have to get, to... do I have to get Terry Tate on you? This ain't new, baby. <laughs> May have to go mute on you. Uh, joining us again, Chris Har from Platinum Achievement Podcast. Hi, Chris. Hi, Chris. Hello. Hello. Hi, Chris. How you doing, man? You should uh, give, give Matt his own time. So let's say if you're going to record at seven. Say to Matt six and a half, so he can make it at seven. Yeah, six thirty. Be like, get on at six thirty, buddy. <laughs> I mean, at least I'm no. not Brian Spagnoli who says, "Yeah, I'll be there," and then just isn't it. <laughs> Brian, <laughs> Brian, Brian, Brian Spagnoli, you give him not like an hour time. You give him like a week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. So let's say we're gonna record this Saturday. We tell him next Saturday, then he comes. He comes, you know. Next one. Right. 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 Yeah. How's everyone doing? What are we playing? Chris, you want to go first since you're our guest? What are you playing, man? What have you been working on lately? I've, been, I've uh, just Platinum Sleep, Sleeping Dogs. Uh, nice. Definitive edition. Yeah. I did see you about that. Yeah. The, the game kind of gets like um, just just... Just, just end. Just the game just doesn't want to end. There's you have to do everything. You have to do everything, and the game will. I, I like the game, but you hate. You will end up hating the game if you want to platinum it because you have to do everything. So there's a lot of everything. grindy yeah. stuff. A lot of grinding. Yes, a lot of. Okay. The problem is you, you can cut all the grind if there was fast travel, and the only way to fast travel is to find a fucking taxi. Then you can just like oh hire a taxi. Then you can. And you cannot fast travel everywhere. Like you well, can only maybe, fast travel. Maybe this is a, maybe it's saying that that you know, maybe it's a commentary on taxis in Hong Kong. Maybe it's just really hard to get a taxi in Hong Kong. It's true, <laughs> or one that gets you there on time. Uh, what if you were to <laughs> compare the grinding? So, 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 that was the worst shot. So you're saying, let's say. <laughs> So they're saying uh, if you if you live if the game is set in New York and you, if you want to be realistic and like be in traffic all the time, mm -hmm. oh yeah, this is so realistic. Uh, this is so much. No, fun. you can't oh, be realistic. But I mean, you know, it was a <laughs> joke. But if you had to compare the grindiness of Sleeping Dogs to Dark Souls Three, I know. is it better or worse? Oh no, it's not. It's, it's not the, the the it's not like Dark Souls three. That's a know. different sport. I mean, that's a way different yeah, sport. Yeah. But it's still grindy. They're still both grindy. So. I feel like yeah. I feel like the, well, yeah, but I. That's I mean, people say that Persona games are like super grindy too, but they're just grindy in a different way. And I think I think that Sleeping Dogs yeah, is, prob maybe. is probably in the uh, in the Grand Theft Auto type grind. Probably. I'd agree with that. Yeah. No, it just adds more time that you don't need to, so. Yeah. So. Cool. Nice. Anything else? Uh, what are you What are you working on now? Did you move on to some right away, or? Did you just... Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I shamelessly platinum the Mr. Uh, Massage. <laughs> That's, hey, platinum's platinum. <laughs> I got two of them this week. Oh yeah, what'd you get? <laughs> a very dumb puzzle game called Energy Cycle. <laughs> it's like a thirty-minute platinum. 
Nice. I did it on PlayStation 4 and Vita. <laughs> and yeah. Oh, right, because they have two separate Platinums for that, don't they? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They have two sets, so it's got two trophy lists? Yep. Six dollars, yeah. two Platinums. I'll take it. Nice. I'm not, I can't, I can't do that. I'm good. <laughs> oh, oh, what, oh, what, you're, you're erudite in your Platinum now? No, no, I just... I'm just joking. I'm, I'll wait till I'll wait till it goes on. Settle down, man. Down. You and I both have the My Name is Mayo Platinum twice. I have the <laughs> five star, one thousand rated Platinum. Okay. <laughs> hey, that, that PlayStation's 14, rare. Your, your PlayStation's rare now because that's not even available on the store anymore. I know it's it's uh you can't even like you could go click on on the page in the store and it's like it's not available. And apparently they haven't fixed their description. For so, because that's the, the developer was saying, Sony took it down, and so the only thing you have to do is like not mention trophies in the description and how easy it is, and they could put it back up on the store. And that was, I think, two weeks ago. That was before I went on vacation. That was like the week before I went on vacation. It's been three weeks since that happened. I'm like, what's going on over there? It's not that hard to change your description. Oh, so, that's so dumb, dude. That's like, yeah. Who cares? If people don't want to buy it, don't buy it. But you know, right. people are uh, like a lot of the PlayStation audience is playing the games for the trophy. And right. like, if people want cheap platinums, that's going to be one of them. You know, well, it's just. I think the problem was a lot of people were complaining to Sony that uh, it cheapens the uh, art of going after platinums. And. Oh, man. But see, yeah, but see, then the thing is, it's kind of Sony's fault. It's not the developer's fault because they approved the game to be up on their store. So it, it brings up the issue of do they need to have a, a group there that goes over all the games that are being submitted for trophies and platinums and make sure, you know, that there's a quality there. But anyways, yeah, so. Yeah, no. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah no, quality. No. After... Don't, 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 uh, those people who talk about, oh, it cheapens the platinum. F- okay, first off, fuck you. You're lying. Second off, <laughs> second off, those, who, those people who complain like that don't care about trophies. Yeah. Period. No, exactly. Period. Exactly. Because, because look, you know, if it, if it was, if it was Hakum or Rough Dog 4, or any of the other top 10 trophy hunters in the world saying, nah, this is kind of bullshit, Sony, you might want to stop. This cheapens trophies, believe us, we know. Yeah. Um, then then you can, then that becomes an argument. But yeah, no, it doesn't. Those are the same people who sit there and, you know, they probably have Hannah Montana and mm-hmm. they platinum it in like three hours. They probably have the Walking Dead season one. They probably have just about every other dumb platinum I could think of off the top of my head. You want to you know what makes getting tro- you want to know what makes trophies painful? A game like goddamn Orc Slayer. Oh my god, <laughs> that, yes. game, that game was rough. Like that, that game, game, that game doesn't even uh, work right. I mean. No. <laughs> no, it, it, I, I totally agree with you. It does not work right, and it, even the even the five the five star one thousand rated puzzle game, whatever the one it is that they took down. Uh, I was working through the trophy list, trying to get the trophies, and I'm like, oh, I got these last two trophies to do, so I'll just do those real quick. And I had you have to select like another like a, another difficulty. You have to do like so many of like a certain difficulty. And I went to go select it again, and the platinum popped. And I'm like, uh, okay. I was like, I didn't even know I did seven. I was, I, I mean, I tried to keep track, and I was like, there's no way that I did that amount. And I'm like, whatever. I'm just, I, I shut it. I, you know, up, uploaded my trophies and then shut it down and deleted it. <laughs> It'll never be on my PS4 again. Sink it. Move on. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I synced. They can. It done. But they can change the description. You know why you're buying this game for, and that's it. Yeah, exactly. You know why you're buying. You like, and yeah, then they just, they, just, they, just, they do me. like the dot dot dot, and then smart dot, 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 to, dot, no, yeah. to move pictures around in a puzzle. And <laughs> no, that, that's here, it, here's yeah. what. Here's how they do it. Here's how they do it. They make it. They they have to just euphemize the entire thing to where it's like an epic story. You are picking this game up. 
you know why you are here. You have been chosen for this journey, for this list of tasks that need to be yeah. that needs to be checked off. Oh, God. And only you can check it off. Because when you check that off, you get a nice shiny item. I, yeah. There you go. And and then mm-hmm. our, and then and then then they do like, you know, they take the stone beer right. They're like, listen, man, are you gonna do it or not? And then, you know. Hell, I'd buy that game already. No, you know what they do? They make this big, long paragraph, but only capitalize the letters that spell out Platinum Trophy. <laughs> or, easy, or Easy Platinum. Yeah. <laughs> platinum <laughs> better. Or Fastest Platinum Trophy. Like, description of, and, like, and, you know, like, all those are the only words they get capitalized. That would be that would be awesome if they did it that way. But, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Matt, what are you playing, man? Um, I, 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 I platinumed energy cycle twice. Um, mm-hmm. so it's, it's a really, wait, you can platinum that twice. Yes. Yeah. Weren't you listening? <laughs> when, he <laughs> yeah, listen when I talk, <laughs> when he was saying, it's, he does, no, it's if I was talking, Chris platinum. is not listening. <laughs> yeah. 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 So. Yeah. No, $6, two platinums, one for Vita, one for PS4. It's, um, it actually, it's kind of the game itself is kind of a variation on like Othello and Go, um, where there are there are circles lit up, and if you if you turn if you change one, all the things adjacent to it uh, upwards or across or vertically or horizontally change with it, and basically yeah. you have you have to get the entire screen to one color. Um, and some of it I found, I mean, most of it I was actually able to just sort of go through and just do. And, and yeah, and there, there, there is a glitch um, where the you, matrix. No, well, where you don't actually have to do um, a couple of the trophies uh, to completion. You can actually, like on the time attack mode and on the infinite mode, you solve the first puzzle and just tap X. And then like five tro- five trophies pop each time. So nice. So yeah, I found I, I found out about that and did that. Um, so yeah, two platinums. I also did some more Spelunkin again. It's always a good time. Uh, I need to get into that. I need to play more of that. Oh. It's it, it's. I mean, take it. I mean, honestly, you have a Vita. Play it on your Vita. Like that. That's whoa. I mean, that is the definitive version of that game as far as I'm concerned. Right. Well, my, my problem is Kelly is now, she's like wanting to play video games. We were talking about it and I was like, that might be one that either will get her to play video games or mm-hmm. destroy our marriage. So No, that won't destroy your marriage. <laughs> I mean, if she if, honestly, I have a feeling if she were to like, if she were to like stealthily, you know, get her own PS4, and then all of a sudden she's like some person that's beating the piss out of you and Bloodborne on a daily, yeah. like, and then she just says, "Hey, I've been kicking your ass all through Yarnum for the past week." Yeah. That'll ruin your marriage. Oh yeah, it will. It will. If she gets the platinum in Bloodborne before I a short <laughs> time with me. Although. To my credit, I was waiting to do it with you. We were we were working on that game together. Yeah, we were so, working on that together. And, well, and, and actually, I'm, I'm actually going to uh, assist Mr. Deerig this week in finally finishing it. So nice. Let me know yeah. when, man. I'll hop in. I'll help you both. But yeah, I mean, the, the people who are hearing this now will uh, are are a week late. It'll be tomorrow night. Um, okay, I'll be on. Cool, I'll be on, man. Yeah, so let me know. Uh, um, anything else? Have you gotten back into some yeah, Persona I got, Five? Uh, yeah, I did. I, so did, an, I did. I did another. T- well, another like dungeon and three quarters in Persona Five. I'm up to the mm-hmm. third dungeon. Game's good, man. A game does not uh, like. I. Th- I think I'm. I'm starting to notice like the the cracks in the wall, as it were. Uh, or okay. the cracks in the foundation, I guess, is probably a better one. But it's not really ruining it for me. I think the chinks, I, the chinks in the armor, you know, sure. like the, the you know, yeah, yeah. And I think that if you like those games, you'll like Persona Five. If you've never really been down with that, you might not be. Um, 
but it is it is super story heavy and i i, I think that, that game is cool man that like i think that that game used narrative it uses narrative devices and metaphor um in a way that that no other game really does um also i last night uh I, I dove back into XCOM Enemy Unknown Plus uh, on the Vita because I had a super slow night at the hospital. And, and uh, what are your thoughts? You liking it? Oh, that game's great. That game was great the first time around. It was great on PS3. I never got a chance to play Enemy Within, but I really want to. Mm-hmm. Um, that, that game's fucking solid. And if nice. you, I mean, if you know what, I mean, it's a, I guess it's a turn-based tactical strategy game i think that's what yeah. it would be called i know chris would probably correct me if you if you if you wanted to um, sleeping that could be as well uh but <laughs> it, th- that game is really fun um i still create all my soldiers and uh Derek and i are dead that's sad that makes we, me sad we got well thanks, we, we thanks matt thanks. <laughs> 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 this one, that one actually was not my fault. All right, it yeah, was, but you could not, no, it's it's mine. Well, I didn't get a chance. I didn't get a chance to move Derek before he got killed. Uh, um, see what happened was Matt no. told me what to do, and I said, "Shut up." <laughs> and then I like, and then I died trying to save him. So um, <laughs> at least like, I'm still alive. Yeah, Moose, 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 Chris, Matt Phillips. And I think Imran are still alive of all the people I created. Am nice. I still alive? Oh yeah, you're like a you're like a lieutenant, man. <laughs> you and nice. you and Moose both have nicknames. Um, nice. Moose, Moose is long shot. I don't remember what yours is, Chris, because the game automatically gives it to you. Oh, that's it's freaking cool. great. <laughs> that is cool. Um, and it seems like ev- after every mission where either one of you is sort of like the one who gets shit done. Um, I unlock another medal to give to a soldier. So I'm like, the game is trying to tell me something. <laughs> it's like, it's like award these two. They're <laughs> they're they're winning this war. Um, yeah, but yeah. The game is so cool. Like, I I wish I wish all of the. I mean, I know XCOM Two is on PS4, and maybe I'll play it at some point. But I wish Enemy Unknown and Enemy Within would get ported to PS4 at some point. But I don't think that'll happen. For X, it doesn't seem like they're into into that. Nah. Uh, so Chris is awesome in any dimension, in video games, in movies, in the future. In movies? And I was going to say movies. Movies. Do you got, you got a porn I mean, there yeah, yeah, I was going to say, you, you got a porn lighting up the yeah. hub? Is that what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> he photoshopped his face yeah, on, yeah. The, on the uh, you know, Paris Hilton one. <laughs> oh, I was. I, I was. I was in a local movie, you know, you guys. No, it's no, all in okay, Arabic. now, but now I, t- I keep telling you, Chris, you're supposed to photo your sh- Photoshop your face onto it's this a, head, not the other one. It's, it's, it's a one. But then it's only like it's smaller than six point six millimeters. <laughs> Centimeters. Learn the matrix system. <laughs> and then, and then he, every time, like that's the one where all the talking is dead. So it's like ah. Uh, all right, Corey. What, do, what have you been playing, man? Well, actually, no. Hang on. Chris was oh, done sorry. talking about how awesome he is. He didn't say what he was playing, did he? No, he did. Oh, he okay. Did first, because he's the guest. Then I. Oh yeah. You, and now we're gonna go to Corey, and I'll go last. So I Corey. pulled a Chris and tuned him out for the yeah. first time ever. It's the first time <laughs> I've ever done that. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Uh. Well, I finished the Zelda DLC. It was. What do you think of it? It was all right. I mean, it was. There, yeah. This isn't the piece of DLC that I want to play in Zelda. This is like the appetizer to what's coming in the fall, but uh. I finally started getting back into Horizon, and I started a new game because I forgot where the heck I was and what I was doing. But like, it doesn't matter. Just kill dinosaurs. It's great. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> but I really like that game, man. I really. It is I, good. I really like that game, and like, you know, I stopped playing it and went back to it after I beat Zelda, and I was like, I can't play this right now because I'm not going to be able to appreciate what this game is doing. I need a break. 
So I played a couple bad games in between, like Mass Effect Andromeda and uh, something else. Okay, I, okay, wait, hang on, hang on. You said you liked Mass Effect. I, 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 was, I really liked the beginning, but as I got further and further into it, it the, the stuff people were complaining about started to show through. Really? Yeah, it just started to ooze through, and I was like, man, I don't want to ruin Mass Effect for myself, so, like, I don't... And I know, like, the Fathers of Grind... I know Tim liked it a lot. Uh, he loved it, but, like... So did Derek, I believe. Yeah, Derek, Derek did, too, and I'm just like, I can't... I don't know if I can continue playing this right now. Like, I want to play something that's going to be good, and then I know I'm going to like, and... You know, I'll I'll go back to Mass Effect eventually when I'm in the mood to play that style of game. But right now, like, I've got three games sitting on my shelf that I really need to play. One is Horizon, one is Near, and I finally picked up Persona Five because Matt has been nice. talking really highly of it. Near is so, a lot of fun. I need to get plan, back to that. My plan is to finish Bloodborne with Matt. I'm I'm gonna tr- go to Platinum Horizon and then I'm gonna play either Near or or Persona. Okay. So. Nice. Yeah, the Platinum in Horizon is attainable pretty yeah. easily in a single. Oh, game. yeah. Yeah, totally. Um, 100% <clears throat> might be a little struggle. So, that's the that's yeah. the bullshit cuz they added they added the new game plus and then they added the ultra hard mode, hard mode, and so you get a trophy for hard, ultra hard mode, correct myself. But you get a trophy for beating the game in New Game Plus, and then you get a trophy for beating it on uh, Ultra Hard Mode. So I started a New Game Plus and immediately went up to Ultra Hard Mode. And my problem is I, I can't remember the controls. So, I, I mean, they're, it's, I'm still all right with them, but I'm like, man, I got to play this for a while because it's just the, they hit like, like freight trains. So yeah. some, of the, yeah, some of the enemies. That's why I started a new game because uh, – you know, I, I kind of forgot what I was doing and what all the weapons did and stuff, and I didn't feel like where I was was not an ideal place of <laughs> uh, testing right. all that out because there's those two, there was two like big of uh, those things with the green sacks on their back, and like oh a bunch, yeah, those guys a, a bunch of villagers around, and I was like, yeah, yeah. this, this yeah. is not the place to be testing figuring out what the controls are. So I just started a new game. So yeah, but I. I I love Horizon, man, and I thought Zelda was for sure my game of the year. Mm-hmm. But yeah. Horizon, Horizon is really inch and closer, and like, you know, nice. When do you, when do you see the end? <laughs> it's 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 challenging Zelda for that top spot. I don't yeah. know. If it'll, I don't know if it'll beat it, but like, it's challenging it for sure. Okay. So when we have our game of the year discussions, I mean, one two will definitely be Horizon and Zelda, unless you know, Mario Odyssey is like. The end all be all of Mario games. So or Destiny Two, even Destiny nah, Two, that won't be game of the year. It'll be fun. That'll be that'll be, that'll be disease of the year for Corey. Ooh, yeah, gotcha. Yeah. All right, we'll he's, like, he's like, you're not wrong. Matt, you're <laughs> not wrong at all. No, no comment. No comment. <laughs> Matt, you might Matt, you might be doing the show for three months by yourself. Uh, what with me? He's got me now. Great. Yeah, but didn't you say you're gonna play Destiny two too? I I might, but I'm not gonna deep dive <laughs> deeply down that rabbit hole like we know you will. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean, I'll be honest with you. I'm gonna be honest, honest with you. The reason I need a third job is so I can afford all the rope. I'm gonna need to pull you back. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, so I guess I'll go last. Current, uh, I've been playing. So I've been gone for like the last week. And a half on vacation, so I took my We had a good time. Yeah, I saw Mr. Keel, which was fun. That was a good time going to Wirebacher and, and watch and me then, fail at nachos again, again. For the second time. And they weren't even that. They weren't even as big as. The, oh as god, the they were. They were better though. They were better though. Oh man, yeah. those nachos were way better. Um, so, so yeah. what you guys were doing together? We went uh, brewery hopping. We hung out, went brewery hopping, uh, mm-hmm. and then just sat and chat, man. It was it was a good time, man. It was a good time. Mm-hmm. But so I I met, I met his family. I met it, I met his family. That was a good time. Yeah. So now now I can officially propose. So you know. Yeah, yeah. So we're we're oh. inching closer. We're yeah. inching closer. Uh huh. 
Yeah, the bromance is being so, taken to the next level. Bromance at full swing. That's what this yeah. is. So, yeah. so who's the catcher? Doesn't matter. Depends no. on who's drunkest. Yeah, that's true. He's right. <laughs> He's right. So anyways, I've been playing. Uh, Facial hair does not bother me at all. Just saying. <laughs> I, I feel like I feel like Matt would be the catcher. You wish. Because then you could right. pretend I'm a girl. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, I uh, I started off with some Symphony of the Night. I was playing that just to ease into using the Vita, and then fire. Uh, I was in an eight-hour car ride up and down, so I fired up Grand Kingdom, which I'm thoroughly enjoying. Grand Kingdom is a great game if you like uh, uh, strategy games, turn-based strategy games. Like it's it's really cool. Art style is good. I like the story, and then. I recently got a code for uh, Fallen Legion, which just launched today. That game looks so good. That game looks so and, goddamn good. And uh, that's a lot of fun. It, uh, uh, I agree with uh, Jason, my co-host from Nerds Gone Platinum. It, if you liked uh, uh, Dragon's Crown, you'll like it. It, it. it has. It might not have the same combat system, but it reminds you of it and this art style is similar and, and the story is really good. So I highly recommend checking that out. I believe both versions are 20 bucks each. If I'm not wrong. And then they, they were running a thing where if you pre-ordered the PS4 version, you got the Vita version for free, but that's over now that it's launched. But anyways, that's what I've been playing. And then when I got, when I got home back on the PS4, I've been uh, helping some people with dark souls, bloodborne, me and Jesse uh, played bloodborne the other night, I think it was Sunday night. So that was fun because he was just, yeah, he was not liking Rom. But anyways, uh, so we did that. But he's so cuddly. He's a little <laughs> like, cuddly spider. Yeah. <laughs> and then like Titanfall too. I, he, his problem, Jesse's problem is he's all right as long as somebody's in the world with him. But as soon, like as soon as you beat a boss and you're gone. So we, the third time we took on Rom, he died right before I hit the killing blow, but I we killed Rom. I was able to kill Rom before he went through his death animation and disappeared. So Rom was dead because the you know prey slaughter came up and right and, you, and you're and you're like okay. I told him I said Rom's dead. And he's like, well, how the heck do I get back to my souls? And I'm like, you have. I'm trying to tell him how to get back up. He wasn't really paying it. To, he must have not been paying attention. <laughs> To get up into the building, <laughs> he, he just so like if you know the shortcut of that of Burger, yeah, he just if you just followed just him. No, he just yeah. he ran right past through the gate, past the opening in the building, and was down getting attacked by the like mosquito looking fly dude, and then the oh, big God. giant like centipede thing, and he was oh he was so angry. He was so angry. He's just like, I'm done. I'm never playing this game again. And I was like, so in about another three, four months, you'll pick it up again. <laughs> he was just, He's like, yeah, call me then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, that's what I've been doing. So.